the spray mount, the, the adhesive or the glue needs to be shaken uh, uh, quite well. It's not too much. And just mix it. And I always spray uh, to to clear the nozzle. I always spray spray somewhere else once it starts going glue. So then it's again um, smooth uh, motion. Don't need that much. It will set fairly quickly. So um, I'll put the. The overlay on. I'll try to align it as much as I can, but it's not too bad. So then you have to really press everywhere to clear if there are any air bubbles. So this will stay flat. So I use my glove, the back of my hand, just a few times just to uh, make it flat. Try not to touch the end of the paper because there's some glue there. So then I'll put some smudges on. Um, yeah, but that, that should be enough. So you try to really. Um, so it's safe to touch. I mean, after this, um, the inkjet fix or adhesive layer, it's fairly safe to touch. And I'll put this aside for, let's say, another half an hour or so to uh, to dry a bit and then I'll put it in, in between a book. For the next design is, is um, aligning um, the top and the uh, the mask, the transparency mask underneath. So I always do it on a lamp well, that it's very um, it's quite fiddly procedure. So it, it really takes takes a while to to align. Um, Once you align them really well, you hold it and clip it one side, check if it's aligned well. I have aligned them very well. I'm just doing it for the video. I have to hold it on a on a higher on a higher lamp, not underneath. It's it's more easier when this is high and, and you hold it like that. After some time aligning them, I think it's it's pretty close. I mean I can really spend like hours trying to align them, probably not an hours, but not hours, but good 20 minutes to align them. But that, that that's fairly good, uh, fairly good alignment. Um, so these, well, oh, it's good for the video. I mean, I'm not using this on my car, so I can uh, for this video. But if if one wants to, you can you can align them really well. Um, what's Useful actually, it's um, and I haven't done it, um, I've done it the wrong way around um, because I have my uh, transparency printed on that side. So if you flip it and, and the ink is underneath, so it will be the really smooth side. So this will slide much easier underneath, so you can really have fine movement. Uh, but for the moment, that, that that's all right. I also put um, um, chopping board, cutting board underneath, so for the clamps to uh, to be pretty level. Uh, you don't need it basically, but um, something like that. So um, so for the for this thing to be to be relatively flat, uh, something like that. Uh, when you when you lift it. You spray it and then put it back so to be kind of flat and new. Uh, I would 
press on top uh, to to flatten it. So I have to have a, another go and because moving it this might have micro shifts in in this. So I'll have to check under the lamp again if everything's aligned and put it again. Maybe check a few more times. And the more you check, the better. So I've checked the alignment. Everything seems all right. I haven't really spent much time. So you would shake this, shake this uh, spray, really, and then spray somewhere else to clear the nozzle. And then this would be flipped. So I'll flip this spray, it not too thick, not too far away. I mean, 15 centimeters or so, and then I'll put it back and. Um, flatten it so it, it will stay flat. Uh, let's see. And this is a bit close to uh, this clamp is a bit close to design, but it's not. I can I can actually flip it. And then put it in, and of course. Try to flatten everything. I mean, now, if if it was on the the shinier surface, you can um, you could put it under the lamp, see how uh, well the alignment is, and uh, perhaps do some adjustments. And this sets really quickly, so there's not really much time to do any adjustments and uh, not really that much opportunity to do adjustments but it's kind of kind of all right and so I've put some some glue in here hopefully it's um, not on the it's not visible on the design uh, basically you don't want to touch the the corners so where you put some glue on the gloves and then this will go on the on the design. Yeah, try to flatten it and then leave it for 10-15 um, minutes and then put it in, in a book to really kind of flatten and the glue can, can spread into different um, into different um, into the different corners everywhere underneath the design. Yesterday, I uh, have to admit, I made a mistake. Uh, well, quite a bit of a mistake. So uh, this is the uh, the the print, the design with, with 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 the green with the green letters. So while I was touching it, so I have touched on the side somewhere where the glue was, and touched with the glove. So there is a, a quite a big uh, smudge there, I think. Um, and I was really not waiting too much for the for the ink to dry, so I had um, uh, two sheets of paper stuck them. So uh, this was stuck to the paper. So um, so I've done it again. Printed another one. So I printed another one of these uh, sheets with, with with the black. So that's no different than the other one. But uh, I made a slight. Um, Change to my to my masking uh, transparency paper. So now um, I flipped it um, horizontally, or vertically actually, not horizontally. So I flipped it vertically, I think. <laughs> uh, I have to double check. Uh, but this is this is the print side. So this is where the print is. So when you uh, flip it around, uh, so you see how it is. This is the back side. Um, the the really smooth side. So um, when you put it, so when you put it on top, you you can get them aligned. So when you put it on top, you can get them aligned. And um, uh, the previous time I filmed this, this was uh, on the rough side. So this is the rough side, and it it, it you cannot align them really well because it doesn't really uh, there is. Um, resistance and you can't quite align them together. So this time around it's on the smooth side so you can easily really move this moves very easily. So you can align them. Um, so initially 
another mistake which I did was I first sprayed the inkjet lacquer or fixative on top and then I glue them together so when you so I uh, now I wouldn't do this again uh, so first you print I would print this um, design uh, then uh, then the masking uh, transparency film I'll stick them together with glue once it has set I'll leave it for 24 hours at least then I'll spray it with the with the inkjet lacquer or fixative because when you spray with the what I realized so that's the that's the actual design so what I realized is that um, this inkjet um, fixative lac lacquer whatever you want to call it um, slightly shrinks the paper here and there so when you align them in some places uh, if it hasn't been glued to a, to a transparency film at the back you can't quite align it I mean I aligned pretty much everywhere except here it was like a half a millimeter off so um, yeah it's a trial and error and um, so, but that that's the correct procedure. So you you get uh, one would get I would get this uh, design. I'll get the transparency flipped. So then align them, glue them these two together, wait for these to set, and then spray the uh, fixative on top. Okay. Right, so let's I'll align these. I'll align them on the a different light, and then I'll glue them together. So I aligned them pretty good this time. I mean, with it slides very easy. I mean, you can slide two sheets when it's not the rough side versus uh, at the back of uh, the design. So I'll shake the uh, the glue spray mount spray somewhere else just to get the glue going and not that much glue I think last time around I sprayed too much glue so uh, just parsley that should be enough you put them and I normally only touch in the to put it only touch the the white bits where you don't have ink so you don't want to really ruin the ink and of course touch it to the sides to glue that together oops And I'll leave that for at least a couple of hours overnight, if possible. And then I'll stick it. Um, I'll cover with a with a with a piece of paper just not to get dust and so on. But um, leave this for uh, at least 24 hours to set before sticking in the in a to to put it in a book.